everybody. So welcome. Today is our last workout of the program, workout four, which is legs and calves. So today I'm going to go through that workout. If you've been following the series, you know that for each exercise we are doing four minutes, as many reps as you can in four minutes on each exercise. One set of that, and then moving on to the next exercise. So what we're going to do today is um, go through the exercises of this workout. And the first one is the band squat. So for the band squat, you want your band and you want, no, we won't use handles, we won't need handles. Basically, what you want to do is step into your band and get into your normal squat distance width, around shoulder width, twisting your feet out 30 degrees. You're going to hold the band overhand and you're basically almost like cleaning it over like so, and you've got the band here. I can then put it up and over the back of my shoulders. Don't put it on your neck, kind of keep your arms up as well. And you can go down into your squat and back up. And you get that resistance at the top and on the way up during the movement. So you're basically gonna do four minutes, as many band squats as you can. So I'll just change angle for it. This one here. So you're going to go as many reps as you can, four minutes. Focus on your form, you get the resistance at the very peak. So at the very top here, you've got the band trying to pull you down, and you're resisting on the way up. So pretty much that's the band squat. So if you're watching this video now, pause the video, and do four minutes of the band squat. So the next exercise we're doing is band step ups. So for the setup, you want to connect your donut at the bottom of the door or at an anchor point. If you can't connect, your, your, you're going to need to be able to connect your donut to an anchor point, pretty much. You're then going to run, run your band through, and try and get it even. So you've got an even band running through the donut, and you're going to attach a handle to each end. So if you can see this, I'm going to put a handle in here. Right, so, another handle. Right. I'll try and get the best angle I can. Get a bench or a chair, something, something similar that you can just basically do your step ups onto. For this exercise, we're gonna do four minutes on one leg and then four minutes on another leg. So pretty much all you have to do is grab your handles, hook them up, oh, yeah, hold them down. You're going to step up onto the bench, stepping back down. Be careful, it really pulls you back, as you can see there. If you're not ready for it, try and hold for a pause count of the second at the top. And then resist. So it's actually getting a fair bit in your core and your legs. So that's the uh, band step ups, so you'll pause the video. And you're going to do four minutes of side for that. Keep using that bench. I'm going to do a body weight split squat. So for the bodyweight split squat, we're not using the bands. And all you gotta do is basically get your foot up on the bench, start close, just have your foot kind of as a guide, try and not um, over flex it, try and just have your toes on it, then hop out. So hop out next, and you're gonna go down and do a split squat. So you're gonna do, on this, you're gonna do four minutes on the left, four minutes on the right. So that's my balance. Hopping out, down into your single leg squat, back up, like so. So we'll pause the video, smashing through this explanation, four minutes each side. This exercise, we're gonna need a band, so we get our bands back, and we're gonna grab your handles back, so they're good to go. So grab a handle on each side, from here. Okay. So we've got our band, we're going to lay our band out, all right, and you basically want to step onto your band as even as you can. Now you can see my stance is a little too wide for the remaining deadlift, so I'm going to bring my stance in, feel a bit better like that, but I think the handles will hang too high, so I'll have to run a little bit of slack through just so that I can, yeah, do this exercise with the right amount of tension. Pretty much what you're gonna do is try and stand up straight. 
So I'm in the straight position here. And then you're going for, you basically skip leg or Romanian deadlift. So hips are going out, coming up through here, like so. I can feel that through the hamstrings already. Yeah. Readjust. So for example, hips will go out. You can see here, if you want to adjust the tension, the handles are probably not as difficult enough. So I can just run a band through. There we go. Now I'm ready for more. Immediately when we walk through that. Like so. So you'll do four minutes. Four minutes of that. Pause the video. And then resume the video once you've done your four minutes. The next exercise we're doing, we're back to our anchor. But we want to tie off our band to make it a singular, to make it a singular attachment, so that we're only putting one, one attachment. Most people are only going to have handles available, and what we're going to basically do, just need to shoot off for this. What we're basically going to do is run it like an ankle cuff. So if you've got an ankle cuff, you can use the ankle cuff, and if you need to be, need access to an automaton, just comment and I'll be able to set you up with a link so you can buy an ankle cuff. Quite handy for the single leg uh, exercises. Um, but you can still use the handle, it just won't be as comfortable. I'm going to use the ankle cuff because I've got the ankle cuff. So pretty much what we're doing here is attaching the band to the caravan. Right, I'm going to put myself into the ankle cuff. And I'm in. So pretty much what we're going to do is going to step out and we're going to raise a leg. So bear with me with balance. I'm not a professional at this one. I haven't done much of this. So we're doing a single leg leg extension. I'm on my best behavior here, trying not to fall over. You can see the tension is already, this is on the easiest band I've got. And I've got definite tension going through my legs. All right, so I'll try and, for example, I've got no, I'll show you from the side. I've got no tension right now, I'm just demonstrating. When you're out full stretch, get your, bent, your leg up and you're basically extending your quad like a leg extension. With the tension of the band, when you get all the way extended here, you're gonna feel the band at its maximum capacity. Also, just like I am here, if you're struggling with balance, just hold on to something as well. You're allowed to hold on to something, that's fine. That's the leg extension, um, and you're going to do four minutes on each leg. Basically, a glute bridge. So, for the glute bridge, bending our legs in, from here, and we're basically making a, making a bridge, squeezing through the glutes. So, do four minutes of those, like so. So, this is another body weight one. So, easy to do. You can do this anywhere. Then, you get your glutes sorted. Four minutes, as many as you can. And when I say as many as you can, try and go through the form. Try and pause for a second. It's not a rush to, to ultimately just get quantity on reps. You also want the technique to be good. So four minutes of the uh, bodyweight glute bridge, and away you go. Okay, so we're on to our last one. And you're gonna want something like a step. Your, a step will do, uh, books will do, anything where you can just raise raise yourself off the ground. And pretty much for this one, the, uh, the setup is a band with two handles. So make sure you get your band out, two handles, and you're good to go. Watch like this. Get the band, and you're good, we're good. So with our band, you wanna basically be able to step on the band and then calf raise. So, that would be like this. Try and get it as even as you can. I'm a shocker for even this. Just from about there. I reckon I'm good. Bring the band up. And now I'm calf raising. You can see it tries to sling shot me back down. I'm just starting to find the rhythm. Now, stepping onto the band, so I've stepped onto the band, I'm bringing the handles up, and then I'm 
going for the calf raise. You can see my grip, similar to how we were squatting at the start with the grip. And I can definitely feel this going through the calf. So this is a great exercise, basically get resistance on the calf raises. That's all. That's all. We've uh, completed the leg workout. Pretty, um, pretty straightforward, the exercises that we've got there. Uh, we've got four workouts that we've done now for the program at Bands at Home. If you're looking for any questions, just comment below and I can go through the bands. I obviously um, have the link there for the ankle cuff, which I think is a little bit more versatile uh, for single leg exercises. You can definitely get that better effect. The handles have a bit, a bit more rough around the edges on there. On the legs, simple workout. You do four minutes, as many reps as you can. You don't have to really you know, think as, as such. You just go on going for it. And um, yeah, I hope, you, I hope you had a great experience doing lockdown bands.